Today, we're diving into a historical figure we all think we know, Thomas Edison. Edison was indeed a powerhouse. He patented over a thousand inventions like making the incandescent light bulb commercially viable, the phonograph and the cinematograph. He truly reshaped how we live. But here's the twist. Beyond the lab, Edison was an aggressive capitalist. He founded companies, acquired patents, and wasn't afraid to wage serious trade wars. His biggest battle? The War of Currents? In the late 19th century, electricity transmission was the new frontier. Edison championed direct current, which he had heavily invested in. But then came Nikola Tesla, backed by George Westinghouse, pushing alternating current. Alternating current was far more efficient for long-distance power transmission and also much stronger, capable of producing more energy. Edison's direct current, on the other hand, was less practical and worked better only for small-scale uses such as batteries. Fearing his empire was at stake, Edison launched an absolutely shocking smear campaign against alternating current. To convince the public that Tesla's current was dangerous, he actually funded public demonstrations where animals, dogs, cats, and famously, an elephant named Topsy in 1903, were electrocuted with alternating current. These horrifying events were filmed and used as propaganda to associate the new current with death and danger. Can you imagine? Today, this is seen as incredibly cruel and unethical, a huge stain on his legacy. While Edison undeniably changed the world with his inventions and his ability to turn science into industry, his methods raise serious questions. Exploitation, manipulation, cruelty to animals, sabotage of rivals, these shadows loom large over his achievements. He wasn't a genius inventor, he was a ruthless businessman, embodying the dark side of progress where technological advancement is driven more by greed than by ethics. Contrast that with Tesla, who had a brilliant mind, but an idealistic spirit, dreaming of free, accessible energy for all. Yet, in the real world, it was Edison and his capital that ultimately prevailed. We look at his actions from a human and ethical perspective. The cruelty and opportunism he displayed truly cast a long shadow over the good.